Hi, this is Pastor Dean. Just a couple of minutes of, of your time. Uh, I'm Pastor Dean Pepin from Healing Hands of Jesus Ministries. I was just getting ready for a sermon that I'm going to be delivering uh, this coming Thursday. We're going to have a beautiful healing service. I hope you can make it. Uh, we'll be uh, at Sage Pond Place, uh, the community room, for, uh, starting at 7.30. It's going to be a magnificent evening. But I was looking at a verse um, Isaiah 9, 6. You, you ought to read this. This was written about 800 years before Christ was born. I, that's why I can't understand why atheists won't look at the Bible and, and take a look at it and see how even, if you, just, if you don't believe anything else, the prophecies will prove that the Bible is true. But Isaiah 9, 6, this was written uh, 800 years before Christ was born. For a child will be born for us, a son will be given to us, and the government will be on his shoulders. He will be named Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Eternal Father, Prince of Peace. That's so beautiful. Came true. And Micah, the prophet Micah, of course, so 300 years before Christ's birth, uh, uh, predicted exactly where he was going to be born. Bethlehem of Ephrathah. Here's a point I'm trying to make. I was thinking about Isaiah 9, 6. And, um, what's the other? Uh, 2 Corinthians 5, 20. I want to go there for a second, too. You see, Jesus was sent to the earth by God the Father to redeem us. Jesus was a citizen of heaven. And we are citizens of heaven. And you know what? I was reading in 2 Corinthians 5.20 that we are ambassadors for Christ. It says, 2 Corinthians 5.20 says, therefore we are ambassadors for Christ. Why are we ambassadors for Christ? Because we're citizens of heaven too. We're no longer citizens of this earth. Therefore we are ambassadors for Christ, certain that God is appealing through us. My gosh, you know, I just want to encourage you tonight. Um, Non-Christians are looking at everything that we Christians are doing. When we use a cuss word, uh, they say, see, there, there, there's a Christian for you, a hypocrite. When we don't do anything that's really on the up and up, they look at us and say, what kind of Christian is he or she? we got to be careful. A Christian does everything with love. Let's be conscious of that. I was just examining my conscience tonight, and I'm saying to myself, you know, I've got to be more loving towards certain people. I've got to be more forgiving. You're an ambassador for Christ. You are a citizen of heaven. Therefore, we are ambassadors for Christ, certain that God is appealing through us. We plead on Christ's behalf, be reconciled to God. Let's all make a conscious effort to be great ambassadors for Jesus Christ. I'm Pastor Dean Pepin. Hope you can come on Thursday night. I'd love to see you. I'd love to hug you. Until tomorrow night. This is Pastor D. God bless. Bye-bye. Where's the button? Here it is.